Gosud is a Norwegian word. A while ago, I was asked if I could be interested in producing a record with a British singer-songwriter. Her name is Hannah White. I had listened to some live recordings of her, and my first thought was, oh, I want to start a band with that woman. So I decided uh, that we that we ra rather should come together and do a concert and see if magic happened. And we did. It was goosebumps from beginning to end. So now we have, they came back to Bergen just to, to make a record. As, so it's kind of a free to make history. It's a, it's a great band with no songs and no singers. And it's a, a great singer-songwriter with just a guitar player and no band put together and it's got to watch it and get goosebumps. So I've ne never played this before, we've never played this before. I hope you like it. <laughs> Everything from soul to bluegrass singing, mm. and, and, and uh, it just seemed to become so extremely natural to coming from uh, London. Yeah, I mean, obvious. I, 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 <laughs> She's up in the mountains in London. She's doing it, her bluegrass. Yeah, but how, but, but how come it? It 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 it, it, it sounds like. Know, do you know what I think? It sounds just like it's really in your DNA. I, I can hear it. Those. Do you know what when? Um, I, I've never been to Spain, right? And mm. I've just got this thing that I I know that my spiritual homeland is in the Spanish mountains. I know that. Right. And when I see myself, I've seen pictures, I've been, I lived in Turkey for a bit. I know the landscape and I know, even though I've never been there, for some reason, my soul is just at ease and it's a mountain and it's an arid space and it's, and I don't know what that's about. You can't explain it because I've just never been. And I just think it's the same with music. Like, I've never been to America, and um, mm. I've never really, I've never played with Americans. But, and I've, you know, like, brought up in London and listened to a lot of music, different music, English music. I wasn't brought up listening to country or folk, anything. No? No. But it's, so, and I've tried to, like, also, I wasn't somebody who kind of trained to do this, so it's just, it's been a, like, a life's process coming to this place where I can, 
I'm comfortable writing the song that I'm comfortable writing. And it's, it's just, so it's taken a long time, but it's, um, it's, I don't, I can't explain it. It's just, I feel very comfortable, my phrasing and everything just, I hope it doesn't sound inauthentic. I hope it doesn't no, sound no, like I'm imitating anything. No, it's completely... Because uh, it is heartfelt, it is... Uh, yeah, I know, it's, it's come from, it's, it's come from your DNA. Yeah, it, 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 it feels it, very, it's, I don't feel like I'm trying to be anything. I feel like I've found my voice and I've yeah. found my... Um, your own taste and musicality. Yeah, my own musicality, yeah. and that is that is it. That's where I. Well, that's where I am. Yeah. Um, and it's not British, but I hope it isn't exactly American either, because I'm not American. It seems to me that your songs comes along uh, uh, very much like uh, Hank Williams songs. It's almost like just uh, diaries. Yeah. Just. Uh, yeah. Very honest. Uh, do you, you write a song rather than write a diary. Yeah. Uh, a song. I do. Song comes out. Yeah. Always, always has done, and it's uh, yeah every. Are they coming fast? Yeah. I can hear so. Too yeah. fast. No, no. <laughs> I, I can hear that. It's a lot of shit songs as well, you know, uh, But yeah. But they, they are what they are. But they are what they are. Yeah. Yeah, because that was another singer songwriter in America, a young one. Also have that thing, he writes songs, and you know, so, and he remembers them forever. Yeah. Without uh, having to. Uh, That's exactly to read. You know, they write a song and remember it forever, so it means a lot. Yeah. And he says that he don't don't have a clue if it, what it is for others, if it's good or bad. What it is to him, it's just what it is. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And they are mostly almost hundred uh, percent. Who is this? His name is Kyle McNeil. Okay. He he is a phenomenal. Yeah. Phenom phenomenal singer songwriter. Okay. I can't wait to get this festival up and we can we get all those kind of uh, whatever uh, all my discoveries up. Lots of my discoveries kind of uh, together together for, for a show uh, could be great backstage. Mm. <laughs> Bringing that, you know, when you're talking about, you know, families playing music together, yeah. that's why I always fantasize about and imagine that what well, that's what I think Americans do that we don't is like it's a way of connecting with anyone who's in the room. Yeah. Anyone, you do it through music. It's yeah. so genuine. It's so yeah. it's it's not a Performance. It's yeah. not an entertainment. It's yeah. a, it's a way of communicating, yeah. um, and I think that's so that is so special. And yeah. every time um, we've had, you know, we used to run a venue, yeah. and every time Americans would come over, yeah. they've got this an inclusive culture that English British people don't have. They yeah. they come on stage. Oh, you play. Come and join us. Yeah, in, that's right, that's and right. we just feel. Oh no, it's your gig. You you play your gig. But they just they invite you into their world. Yeah. Um, because it means something. Yeah. It's not English people don't do that. There's a different relationship. <laughs> well, we just—it's not our culture. Yeah. It's just not—it's not in our culture to. Yeah, we have a di we perform for a different reason. So here we are, Hannah White and the Nordic Connection. Yeah.
<laughs> what are your thoughts about that? Are there some Vikings from Norway? Uh, we're, we're, we're talking about yeah. do really Americana music here. Uh, it's, it's really uh, surreal because it is so American. Yeah. It's so um, rootsy and powerful and, and it's just that, you know, half of us are from London and half of us are from Bergen. It's not, it's, it's just not what you'd think. Yeah coming out of those spaces. And I, I still feel like I'm coming to terms with it because it's just so new. Yeah, same. And I've, I'm playing songs that obviously I wrote and so I know them, but they, they've, they're just different. They've taken on a completely different life and different level. And because every person who's like playing them yeah. brings so much yeah. and brings so much. So it's just, it's taking it off and taking it off and taking it off and yeah. it's, it's, I, yeah, it's all buzzing in my head, but I yeah. haven't, I'm still coming to terms with it, I feel like. Get goosebumps. The smooth muscles has to be involved, and you can't control that. See you next time.